And welcome back, everybody, once again to Strawberry Jam number 15, Castles, Cathedrals, and Citadels. We are still playing uh, Citadel Raiders by Paradox, and I am TJ the Obscure here with you. That is such a mouthful to have to say every single time, but I don't mind. So, this has been, I think, maybe the longest Strawberry Jam. There's just so many entries. I think this might be the last one. I'm not entirely sure. There could be one or two still left to do. Uh, some people even released multiple jam maps. Uh, and honestly, I was ready to give up on this one. That We still have one objective left to find. Um, and I climbed on top of the giant castle that we went to last episode. I searched all around, could not find anything. So I decided to head back here to the Thieves' Forest. And what do you know, it looks like there's a path that goes off in uh, this direction. I thought it kind of wrapped around, though, didn't it? I thought that's, that's what was going on. I guess I could be wrong about that. Because this does not appear to be wrapping around anywhere. Um, plus, like, why would this one be over here if, if, because the objective that we got last episode was the third objective. I don't know, the, the layout is confusing me. Where'd the other one go? There you are, guy. Whee, and up we go. I guess we could not hit him for some reason. We just need to get over here and take out the friggin' spawners is what we need to do. There's one. And nope. I feel super powerful right now. Will you get off me, people. I'm trying to trying to destroy your home here. Thank you. Oh my gosh, they're so they're so annoying. So annoying. So very annoying. There you go. You guys fight each other. And and I'm just getting destroyed, but I don't care because uh, I am super duper powerful. I guess my armor is getting kind of low here. Ha! You are dead now. Dang skeleton. That That is me not trying hard whatsoever. <laughs> that is me just letting Minecraft do its thing and just getting bounced around by the mobs. Uh, but that's kind of how I'm feeling today. Just go with the flow. Just go with the flow. And see see what happens. I love the sword with the knockback. Hey, there's a chest here. With a protection for diamond helmet. Thank you very much. Just in time. And I suppose we'll take that stuff. I'm actually just going to go ahead and get rid of that. I don't think we really need it. We have the golden apples and the pork chops. Um, Alright. Take a U out to the ball game. More golden apples for us. Uh, no thank you. We do not want it. Oh, I'm getting momentarily momentary uh, stuttering. Okay. Okay, this looks promising. Looks like maybe where we want to be. Oh gosh, I was like, what is that? Because all I saw was the outline right here of the flower. <laughs> I, th I thought it was like a floating blaze rod or something. Oh, I'm seeing things. Go away. And burn to death, you evil, evil zombie. Alright, I see blaze spawners. I see lots and lots of the blaze spawners. Uh, I guess we could go ahead and refresh our torches. Makes sense to me. And maybe we'll just go ahead and take some regen and some strength. I think is what we'll do. Yeah, why not? That and... That and end of pearl on the bar and kill a ghast. Okay, I don't have time for reading the signs at this at this point in time. You know what I really need? I really need a better a better pick is what I need. Um. Oh man, there's a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff going on. A lot of stuff. We need to take out the gas spawners first and foremost. Um, so let's go ahead and take out you. And you. Oh, gosh dang it. My, my mouse. My mouse is not being nice to me. My mouse is not being nice. Right, and you. 
you take care of... I hate to say it, but I think our gear might be a little overpowered at this point. Oh, stop hiding. Stop hiding. You dang gas, you. Alright, um... Whoa, whoa, where did you come from, guy? Okay, our armor is getting kind of low here. I do not know where he came from. I don't know where these blazes are coming from either. It looks like there may be a bunch of spawners inside. Gosh dang it. Inside of the, uh... Inside of the walls here. Interestingly enough. I should have just killed that creeper. Hey, look, we found it. We found a spawner, at least. Oh gosh, this is not good. This is not good, you guys. This is not good. You know what? Let's, let's just go ahead and... Eat one of you. Just because we can. Oh, there's the, uh... Oh gosh, okay. Interesting. I just need to get up... Up and away, maybe? Okay, okay. Build them a staircase. Build them a staircase. We need to take out these blaze spawners. Alright, is that everybody? Get out of my face, please! And I don't know where these remaining gas spawners are. Or how many gas are even left. How's my armor looking? Oh, something got blown up. That's not good. That is not good whatsoever. Thankfully, I think all the silverfish are dead. Um, you... Okay, okay, what do we have? What do we have? Let's light you up. That is empty. I hear more of the uh, vindicators, whatever the heck they're called. Yep, you guys are all right there. And now you are no longer there. I see what's going on here, I think. You're on fire, guy. You're on fire. Better be careful. That, and that, and I think that we'll pretty much be out of range. Light you up. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, right? 40 seconds of poison? Gosh dang it. Gosh dang it, Jim. Whoa, well, look at my absorption. I guess that's because of... Hey, look at that. Just in time, too. Um, sure, why not? Power three. No, thank you. Do not need it. All right. All right. Go away. Is there something in here, too? No, things seem relatively calm. We have diamond... We have that, which we don't need. Some jump boost. Interesting. I guess I should probably take it just in case, huh? That's that's much better. Oh, let's go ahead and collect all this stuff. Uh, you be gone, and you be gone. And... I don't know if we're going to need the chorus fruit, but... An infinity bow, no thank you. What is... Doesn't this stuff teleport you if you eat it? Whoa. Okay. Huh. That... That might be interesting to use. I'd like to see that used in a map, actually. That would be... A lot of fun. Pretty crazy, too. Um... Okay. Sharpness 3, Smite 3. That's actually pretty good. I don't think we're going to be using that. And a speed potion. Let's just go ahead and exchange those. And some regen. Alright. Uh, I don't know. I like I like this one that I have, I think. Even though that would be better against undead. I don't know where this other blaze is. Um, stick of destiny. This item is required to beat the map. Okay, the only thing that I need are the pants, right? I think so. Although those are... Those are a little better, but... Whatever, another notch apple, huh? Oh, it's not the same, though. 
you be gone. Let's take you. And we'll do something like that, I suppose. Alright. Uh, what do we need the blaze rod for, exactly? Let's go ahead and take you guys out. While we're here. Wee. Um. Ooh, just got it barely, just barely. There you are, dang skeleton. And there's that guy. Okay. Uh, you aren't beefy enough to break down this door. Maybe a special tool might be of assistance. Um, were we supposed to find a... Uh, a diamond pick somewhere? I'm not entirely sure. I don't recall seeing one. I guess we can make one though, right? Perhaps that is what this diamond is here for. Go ahead and make a uh, crafting bench. Alright, let's go ahead and dig this out. I hear lots of those guys. Okay. Uh, maybe this won't work. Maybe we have to trigger something else for the bedrock to disappear. Okay, no, no, no. We're we're here. We're here. Um, they can hit me through the, uh, hit me through the thing. Let's go ahead and do this so that we can get a better, uh, better peek in this place. See what we're actually dealing with. There are quite a few of these guys. We can try to thin them down a little bit, because dealing with that many is going to be pretty rough, I have a feeling. Alright, let's go ahead and eat an apple. Um, and do that. And let's get in here and start placing light down and whatnot. Oh gosh. Interesting. But I think we managed to get a lot of them to track us. Dude, I don't know if they still spawn in light or not. It almost looks like they might. Oh, it's completely lit up now. So I guess we'll figure out if they do. I like the difficulty level here. Uh, I don't know where you came from, Mr. Spider, but we're gonna, just gonna go ahead and kill you. I don't know if you're a new spawn or what guy, but but hopefully, ooh, there's there's some armor right there. I wonder if there's anything behind any of the paintings. Uh, let's go ahead and see what this is. If we can. 
What are you? Protection 2. No, thank you. I guess we can hold on to you, though. Um, and you are. Protection 4. I honestly think, I think I'd rather have those. Uh, okay. Blast protection. Is that protection 6? Oh, wow. Okay. I thought it was just regular protection 4. Secrets, secrets, no secrets. Really? Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. Those are Vex spawners, but they don't seem to be working. This has quite a legendary vibe to it. Oh gosh, I didn't even notice the dispensers. Yes, it does. Yes, it does. Go ahead and do that. Um, we should be able to safely get over there, I think. And we do have our ender pearl. I just remembered I have iron. So I can make a bucket right now if I wanted to. Whatever. That's, that's... To make a bucket and... Uh... Get water would take some time, I think. Alright. I don't know what I'm doing. These are... Pig spawners, interesting. Not all of them, though. And you. Never gonna run out of arrows. Never ever gonna run out of arrows. This is not really challenging. I'm, I'm kind of surprised that this design ever even... So, <laughs> I don't know, maybe it was harder back in uh, in beta. But it just doesn't really seem to be all that effective every time I've run into it. Oh, come on. I need, I need a better pick. That's one thing that's missing from this map, or is it good good pick or like an efficiency book or something all right i like how large this uh, this final dungeon is as well is as well i'm assuming, assuming you guys were just spawning from the other spawners right a bed uh sure why not we'll go ahead and do that and we'll stick up some of this extra gear and whatnot some tnt very fun and very happy Resistance. That could be useful. Another totem of undying. Let's stick that up just in case we end up needing it for whatever reason. Um, the lift, it says. The last room of the area is a lift that will progress downwards one block every 15 seconds. As the lift progresses downwards, cages along the walls will open up, releasing mobs. The walls around the lift are silverfish, so don't bother trying to skirt around the lift. When the lift reaches the bottom, you will find the objective. Anything placed on the lift will not move down with it as it falls. This means blocks will stay in the air and torches will break off the lift. The lift will also not repair itself naturally, but you can repair it with your own blocks. Also, the hay blocks in the center of the lift will negate most of the fall damage you would take upon falling on them. So use them as an easy way to get back down the lift. But what does that say? The hay blocks. Okay. The lift may be subject to explosions while traveling down. Keep this in mind. Don't dig in the walls. Interesting. Um, okay. I think I am going to go back and make a bucket, actually. It'll make me feel safer. We only have the one ender pearl, and if we're dealing with lava or void, the bucket could uh, could be quite valuable. So I'll be back with you here uh, momentarily. Alright, I think that I am ready to go. I'm not sure how this is actually going to work. I'm assuming that we just go and step inside. Let's go ahead and take the strength and the speed. And we'll have everything else ready for us. Um, okay, or maybe... Maybe we're supposed to go down here? 
Light that up. And light you up. Yeah, I'm assuming that we want to... Whoa. Did it go down? I think it went down. Um... Okay, interesting. I think it's going down. Yeah, there it goes. It's a little slow, though. Go away, guy. It's very slow, in fact. Can't I just ender pearl down there? <laughs> is that is that something I can do? Cause this is gonna take it's gonna take forever. We'll just make sure we keep lighting things up. We can destroy the spawners before they can even get to us. Oh, so that shouldn't be that shouldn't be too bad. I do have to say that I am uh, a little disappointed thus far at this final elevator thing. It sounded cool whenever it was being described, but this is a little underwhelming. Uh, maybe, maybe it's going to get a lot easier. I mean, a lot harder <laughs> as uh, as we go farther down. But I almost feel like I could just, I could just, yeah, yeah, just easily make it through here without too many issues whatsoever. Come on, you can do it, guy. Hit him. Well done, well done. This one, I believe, is a creeper spawner. Boom! Big explosion. Oh, that's probably not good. Probably not good. Hey! Why are you guys spawning? What are you? What are you? Anything else that we need? I don't think so. Resistance. More of the resistance. There's that. And that. Another chest. Same thing. Oh, but we got a potato. So that's nice. Yeah, just go ahead and blow up your thing there, guy. Or not. Or not. I think you let out some silverfish, maybe. I don't know where you guys came from. Gosh dang it. I think it's the uh, sweep attack thing that summons the uh, the silverfish. You know, what the the saddest part about this is that I'm pretty sure um, Paradox like updated the map to make this final section easier. I wish I could have played like the original. Because overall it's it's felt a little on the easy side. Oh come on things, work for me. I 
It's so dark, so very dark. That is not my axe guy. Oh gosh dang it. I'm very upset. I'm very upset with the silverfish and the thorns and my, my mouse and just everything. I think that we're at the uh bottom maybe. I apologize for the hell that this area has been in the past. Yeah, it needs to be more hellish. Flower of victory. Um, Alright, there's the third and final objective. And to get back up... How do we... Are we supposed to go... Down to that thing over there? Maybe. Maybe. We can do that. Alright. Yeah, that uh that that last area. Again, the concept is is interesting, but um totally totally anticlimactic. Just really slow, really easy. And particularly with the gear that I have, I was expecting like like twenty charge creepers and skellies with punch bows and all kinds of stuff, and we didn't we didn't get any of that, unfortunately. Oh, but anyways, we got the uh, third and final objective. I will see you guys back at the monument. All right, there it is. The final objective, Citadel Raiders, has been completed. A uh, pretty cool looking monument, I must say. And overall, I really enjoyed the map. Uh, just that, that last, I, I think my favorite area was probably the Thieves, Thieves Forest, and that boss that we fought was pretty, pretty interesting, I must say. Um, but I think whatever balancing decisions you made on that last area need to be <laughs> reconsidered. So, anyways, you guys, that's going to be it for me for today. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time.